Today, I'm finally building my permanent base in our Minecraft SMP. Oh, and by the way, I'm building it right under Spy Cake's castle. I have no idea where I am. Oh, okay, this seems like the end of the cave. I'm not sure why I was in a cave last time I respawned, but that's okay. I'm also starving. Let me eat a loaf of bread. Okay, so like I said, today we're finally building my permanent base. So I had that little sky base, but then OB covered it with lava. Then he covered it with water. Today, I want to make a nice big permanent base. And like I said, I think I'm going to put it under spy cakes castle because i think that would be hilarious i haven't done a single prank yet in this smp today's the day that that kind of changes well the first thing i need to do is find spy cakes castle i literally have no idea where it is i'm either going the wrong way or the right way i guess those would be really the only two options is this uh i'm i'm completely lost I'll let you know when I find his castle. Two hours later. I found it! That only took me like, you know, three or four hours to find his castle because believe it or not, I was going in the complete opposite direction. So this is what we need to do. We need to dig a hole under Spy Cake's castle and then kind of hollow it all out. I'm pretty sure he had like a dungeon and a jail because I'm pretty sure I got thrown in jail. What was that sound? Okay, I got it. I got a sword. Let's take the stupid- Hey, hey! Ugh, ugh! Die, you stupid zombie. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna start digging under his castle. We'll see how it goes. Okay, so this is kind of what I'm doing. I'm just basically building a little mine. Don't forget to smack that like button and make sure you guys subscribe to the channel right now. Okay, let's put down a couple torches so I can actually see. Why has it been nighttime this entire video? Is this literally the longest night in the history of Minecraft? I don't know. Here we go. Are we getting close? I heard a cat. What? Why do I hear a cat? Is that maybe Spy Cake's cat? I'm not sure. I might have actually gotten under Spy Cake's base. Again, I thought he had a like a, a jail or like some sort of a dungeon. But you know what? Maybe I already got under there. I think we're good to go. Let's hollow this area out and let. Oh wait a second. This is something. Ah, okay, okay, I knew it. I knew Spy Cakes wasn't gonna make it that easy. I'm gonna have to dig a little bit lower. Oh, no, it's his axolotl. Oh, no, I don't want to kill his axolotl. Um, I, I think Spy Cakes might have made, like, an axolotl aquarium, and now I almost just killed the axolotl. Oh, my gosh, I am such a terrible person sometimes. Let me try to uh, close off the aquarium. Uh, yeah, we'll just use dirt. Okay, sorry, little axolotl man. Uh, I think you're okay. Okay, let's let's start mining a little bit lower. Clearly that wasn't low enough. By the way, you guys can't tell spy cakes about this because this is a prank. It's not a very mean prank, but it's it's kind of a funny prank. Eventually he'll find out that I'm literally living below him. I think I am finally low enough that I will not run into anything that spy cakes had. Time to clear out a space for my base. Hey, space, base. I kind of rhymed. Okay, I have cleared out a pretty nice space for my base. I'm probably gonna make it bigger over time. I also have enough cobblestone to build like a, a small Amazon warehouse right now. Let's put a little torch right here. Do I have a bed? I literally don't have a, a bed. Well, I might have to sneak into Spy Cake's castle and steal his bed to kind of complete the prank. Uh, so this is what I'm gonna do. First things first, this is not where I want my entrance to be. I want to somehow enter through Spy Cake's base because I think it'll kind of be funny if he wakes up and is just like, wait, I don't remember this door being here. And then he just finds my base. But first things first, let me make a furnace. Believe it or not, I still don't have a furnace, which is kind of embarrassing. So let's put a furnace right there. I need to go out and get some wool so I can make a bed. Well, believe it or not, it's actually daytime now. Like I said, it was the longest night in the history of Minecraft, but it's finally over. Get over here, you darn sheep. I'm gonna name you Sherry. It's Sherry the sheep. Get back here. Oh my gosh, okay, I got one. Oh, I know I could just use shears and just like, you know, not kill the sheep, but I don't have shears right now. And I could use the meat too. Okay, do I have three things of wool? I have two things of white wool and one thing of light gray wool. All right, I need one more white sheep. Ah, I see my future victim. I'm gonna name that one. What did we have? We had Sherry. Uh, this is Jerry. We had Sherry and Jerry. Again, I don't know why I named the sheep right before I'm about to slaughter them. It just makes it so much worse. Okay, so now we've got three things of wool. We should be able to make our bed. So we need to do that and we need to do that. And ladies and gentlemen, I officially have a bed. Where do I want to put it? Um, this seems like a wonderful spot to sleep. Uh, let me set my respawn point. Okay, so if I die, 
At least I wake up here now. Not in the middle of a cave. Oh, you know what I also want to build? Everybody cover your eyes. There is about to be a large chest on screen. So let's do one. Let's do two. Okay, I don't think I've had like a, a serviceable chest in my Minecraft bases in a while. Beautiful. Now I can keep all my stuff here. So if you guys missed last video, I explored the brand new update. So I got some raw copper. I got some cobbled deep slate and I got a bunch of other stuff too. Oh, I actually have four diamonds. I don't remember getting the diamonds. And we actually got a glow ink sack too because we found a, a glow jellyfish or a squid. I don't know, but it was awesome. Okay, so here's the question. How do I want to break in? I could literally just go around and walk through the front door, but that's not my style. I'm going to pick a berry there. I'm going to... Ow! Okay, you know what? I'm getting rid of the darn berry plants. You could yell at me for spy cakes. I don't know. Okay. We have infiltrated the wall. Let me put the cobblestone back there because I'm not a monster. One, and there is a cat somewhere, and it's probably not happy with me. Okay, so we've infiltrated the castle wall. But we're actually not in the castle right now. That dude's got a big nose. Kind of like me. Okay, so this is the entrance to Spy Cake's castle. Let me close that. I don't exactly know where my base is, but I'm gonna find out. Whoa, Spy's got like a spiral staircase that goes all the way down. I have not seen this yet. This is really cool. Oh, and I think I see the aquarium. This is the Axolotl Aquarium that I... Nearly destroyed like five minutes earlier. Okay, so we have to be getting pretty close. So you know what we can do? I can somehow put like a secret entrance to my base somewhere in here. You know what? I have a plan. Maybe you need to climb up into the aquarium to get down into my base. That could be really cool. So you know what we're going to do? First things first, I'm actually just going to dig right down here into the cobblestone. And I just want to see how far I need to dig till I get to my base. I feel like I have to be getting close. Okay, I finally found it. So if I look straight up, that's Spy Cakes Castle. So that means that my base is indeed below Spy Cakes. So what I'm gonna do now, I, I really have no idea. I have a new plan and this one's actually gonna work. I just need a lot of sand. Let me do that real quick. All right, I found a giant patch of sand and a really majestic and beautiful horse. I'm gonna name it, uh, Jeffrey. It's, it's Jeffrey the horse. I don't know. I feel like I use the same names every time. Oh, I didn't want to fill this in with water. Uh, let's cover that out. All right. I'm going to dig up. I'm going to need a lot of sand. Like, probably like 25 or 30 things of sand. Spoiler alert. We're making glass. All right. I feel like that should be plenty of sand. Jeffrey, do you think that's enough sand? He seems to really think so. Yep, he, he told me um, in his horse language that that's plenty of sand. What do I have? Oh, I got 66 things of sand. Okay, that's more than enough. Okay, now what I need to do, first thing I want to make another furnace because this is going to take a long time. I'm going to turn all of that sand that I just dug out into glass. I'm going to make one more furnace. It's my dream come true. Three furnaces... Uh, all stacked on top of each other. I don't know why that's my dream come true, but it is. All right, I got six things of glass here. I got seven things of glass here. And I got eight things of glass here. 21. That should be more than enough. Okay, so let's actually go through our first version of the secret entrance, but this isn't going to be the main secret entrance. I think this is it. Nope. Oh, darn it. That was water again. No, nope. darn it. Darn it. Darn it. Darn it. Darn it. I am so bad at this. So bad at this. I'm actually getting just a little bit more glass. Now I have 40. That should be plenty. All right. Now I am finally building the secret entrance. This base is the most pitiful thing I've ever seen in my life, but I have three furnaces. Okay. So this is what I finally have planned and I think is actually going to work. I'm going to build an aquarium inside of an aquarium, but my aquarium's not going to have any water and it's not going to have any fish in it. So I'm not going to kill his axolotl. If this works correctly, Spy Cakes will hopefully not be able to tell that I've done this. And I literally need one more thing of glass. Oh, let me go back down to my base and get that last block of glass. Okay, I got basically all the glass I have. Let's fill it in. No axolotl were hurt in the making of this video, which is kind of nice. Uh, all right, so now what I need to do is fill it all in with... I don't know if I need to use dirt, but I know OB always uses dirt when he gets rid of water from areas. Okay, let's do that, do that, that, and that. Okay, so now if I dig down... Is all of that stuff gone? There shouldn't be water in here. 
Perfect. There's no water. Yes. Okay. We're actually going to do this guys. So this is what we're going to do. I'm going to get rid of this for now, but I'm actually going to put that back because spy will definitely notice. What is that? A shroom light. Spy will definitely notice that there is not a shroom light here. All right, let's dig straight down until we get to my base. I'm going to build a ladder directly up. And then I'll show you. I'll show you. You guys will get it in a minute. Okay, so here we go. Now what I need to do is I need to get a bunch of ladders again. But we're going to go directly back up. And that's, that's Spy Cake's base right there. I am looking from my base into Spy Cake's base. This is actually kind of hilarious. So if we just start building ladders all the way up, this is perfect. And now what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to get rid of one ladder right here. Oh, this is kind of tricky. Okay, I found a spot to balance on the side of the ladder. Okay, this seems like it'll work. Very tricky. I want to put the shroom light there. <laughs> So Spy won't notice that it's gone. How do I- There we go. Perfect. This is exactly what I wanted. Oh, wait. Now, how do I get back up? Okay, so there's a couple things that I need to work out. For now, I'm just going to put a ladder, but I feel like that's going to be, like, very obvious to see. But let's see what it looks like. If I do that, I should be able to jump out. Okay. Ladies and gentlemen, we have kind of done it. Let me know in the comments if you know of a better way. He's definitely going to be able to tell, but that's okay. He's not going to know what's there, and maybe he'll explore. So this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to go up here. I'm going to go into the aquarium, into my side of the aquarium, go down my ladder that's extraordinarily obvious, break his shroom light finger majigger, put it back, and now I can go all the way down in into my base. This actually worked out pretty well. I have officially built a base under Spy Cake's castle. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and check out my other YouTube channel, guys. It's called TFG Vlogs. Go to that channel right now and subscribe. And I will see all of you in the next video.